Hi you guys, welcome to my video. I have my weekly Walmart grocery haul to share with you today and I also am gonna share with you our meal plan for the week on what we're having for dinner each day. So I have my meal plan right here, so I'll share that with you. I'm gonna show you all the groceries that we got. I pick up groceries once a week. It is a total time saver for me. So I plan out all of our meals and plan out all the groceries that we need. It also helps me stay on budget when I plan everything out. I like to stay under $200 per week. This week I was under, which is so awesome because last week I was over it, like $201. But this week I was at $189. So I love being under $200 for the whole week. So I'm gonna show you everything we got. If you enjoy watching grocery hauls and if you need some meal plan motivation, make sure you click subscribe to my channel. I share with you every week the groceries that we get and the meal plan that we're having. So make sure you subscribe, click the bell button, give this video a thumbs up if you enjoy it and always leave me a comment if you have any questions at all. So I'm gonna get into showing you all the groceries that I got for the week. So uh, here is everything that I got. So I do one Walmart order for the week and I get everything that we, that we need. I even get our things that, other things. So our bath soap, a bubble bath, toothpaste for the kids, collagen for my husband and I. But um, I love Walmart. I can just pick up everything that we need for the week. I got toilet paper last week. So I just love that I can get it all in one stop. So I will show you everything I got over here and then I will show you our meal plan. So two 18 packs of eggs. If you've been around my channel, you know I get two 18 packs every single week. We eat a ton of eggs. Um, two things of cream cheese because I'm going to use them for a dip that I'm making. I needed some butter to stock up on. I got some ice cream as a treat and vanilla bean is so good. I get a ton of the Walmart great value brand items. I think they're just as good as the more expensive ones. So some vanilla bean ice cream. We get about a gallon of milk every week and we get our almond milk every week. Another thing we get all the time, sandwich thins. So we needed some barbecue sauce. This is our favorite barbecue sauce, Sweet Baby Ray's. It is so, so good. So we needed some barbecue sauce. I am going to be making a dessert to take to a function. So I got this yellow cake mix, but I am going to make a video on the dessert. It is an apple pie crock pot dessert, and it is going to be so, so good. So I will make a video, so check back for that. I'm going to make a video when I make that. So I'm going to do one day this week, this week burrito bowls in the crock pot. So I'm going to have my Rotel corn. I love lentils in our burrito bowls. So these are so awesome. This is the great value brand, but it's organic. Super good. Uh, these are so healthy for you. Super high in protein and high in fiber. Black beans also high in protein and high in fiber. So this will all go in my burrito bowls. So I get this chili with no beans, and this goes in the dip with the cream cheese. It is so, so good. It is so easy. It's chili and cream cheese, and then you heat it up. I do it in a crock pot, and then you serve it with a side of tortilla chips. So, so good. I got some corn that we'll have for dinner one night, and some broccoli. My family's favorite vegetable is broccoli. And then I got asparagus as well. I'm gonna do an asparagus stuffed chicken for my meal prep this week. So make sure you check back for that video. I have this apple pie filling, which is gonna be with that, um, that yellow cake. So that's gonna be for that. I thought we would try this great value brand cereal because cereal is so expensive, um, but this is supposed to be just like the honey bunches of oats which we really like and Trader Joe's makes a version of Honey Bunches of Oats and it's really, really good, but it's almost $5 a box and this was like two eighty dollars for this box. So I thought we'd give that a shot. So last week, Walmart substituted um, the oatmeal for the regular uh, brand of oatmeal instead of the great value and my kids said, what is up with the oatmeal? They thought it was totally different. So they're weird and they prefer the Great Value brand now because I get so many Great Value products. But 
I got some of this to stock up, big 20 pack. And we needed some raspberry jam. Got our apples for the week, our cheese that you guys all know. We make tons of quesadillas, tons of cheese on tacos. We do tacos once a week. And so we go through cheese. <laughs> some mozzarella cheese. I'll use that with my stuffed chicken. Um, some chopped spinach. I love adding frozen chopped spinach in things like my eggs and just all kinds of dishes to throw it into, especially like casseroles, stuff like that. I have some sliced turkey breast. I love this one, oven roasted, but it's a big pack and it is great. I like to use it with a slice of cheese on a keto tortilla and do like a pinwheel with like some ranch and spinach and make kind of a pinwheel wrap. So I love, love <laughs> deli turkey. I got two things of vanilla Greek yogurt because we were totally out and my husband loves this as snacks. And they were out and they substituted this granola from the granola that we usually get. But I got two different kinds, the honey roasted and this one is the French vanilla almond. So we'll try these two out, see how they are. My husband likes to put it on the yogurt and so we will see. My kids like to eat it just plain. So we'll see if those are pretty good. But I got a bag of tortilla chips. I used to get so many tortilla chips. We used to go through them all the time. But the ones I really liked were the Great Value brand, the Walmart brand. And um, they're not making them anymore, I guess. I have not been able to get them. So I just got some of these regular. They're white corn, but this brand they always have. So we were getting some chips this week. I got a pork loin. My kids love pork loin. Super easy to make and really great for dinner. Pack of chicken. We get a pack of chicken every week for everything. Salad, sandwiches, grill it up. And um, we love chicken. Our avocados for the week. So these are pretty green, but they have been, they're usually pretty green when I pick them up because I don't get to go in and pick out my produce, but they have been really, really good lately after they sit for a few days and ripen. So I love avocado. And so these have been delicious. So I'm sure these ones will be just as good. I got a big bag of walnuts. And again, my husband, he likes to put these on the Greek yogurt also, and also mix that in with the honey bunches of oats granola. But that I'm going to also use these walnuts in the apple pie filling dessert. So that'll be super good. Got a frozen pizza because Benjamin requested that we have pizza one night this week. Um, our bananas for the week. If you've been around my channel, you know how much I love this collagen. So I get it every other week because we use it a ton. Toothpaste for the kids. This is the kind they like. Um, bath wash for the kids and bubble bath. They've been taking a lot of baths lately. So it's been kind of fun to do bubbles in the bubble bath. Instead of showers, they've been doing more baths than showers lately. So here is, so here's, this is all of the food, everything for the week. Here is the meal plan. So I have it for Sunday. We're going to do pulled pork. I have one in the freezer that I got at Grocery Outlet a few weeks ago. So I am going to pull that out. We're going to do pulled pork sandwiches. And I love having a big batch of pulled pork ready and adding it on salads as well. Really good. Uh, we're going to do teriyaki chicken bowls. So we do a teriyaki chicken and then rice and broccoli. We're going to do tacos because we do tacos every Tuesday. We have soccer on Tuesdays and Thursdays. We also have soccer on Mondays, but we get home later on Tuesdays and Thursdays. So definitely need super easy dinners on those nights. So tacos, super quick. Wednesday, we're going to do pizza. Thursday, I'm going to do the crock pot burrito bowls because I want to have something ready to go when we get home after practice. Friday, we're gonna do pork loin with broccoli and Saturday, we are going out. So I am not making dinner. For meal prep for this week, I'm gonna do the asparagus stuffed chicken and then I'm gonna make some chocolate protein balls. I made some regular peanut butter protein balls a couple weeks ago and we just love having those around. They're a big hit. So I'm gonna make some chocolate ones for this week. So this is everything that we got. I hope you enjoyed this haul. I hope it gave you some ideas of what to get for your groceries for the week. Hope it gave you some motivation to do some meal planning because 
meal planning definitely saves me a lot of time during the week and a lot of stress just taken taken off knowing that we have a whole bunch of meals that we can put together really easily. So I hope you enjoyed this one. Leave me a comment if you have any questions and don't forget to subscribe also if you're new and I will see you guys all next time. I hope that you have a really wonderful day. Bye-bye.